I'm going to talk to you today a little bit about adding a new section um, to the Walt Whitman Archive, and this should be up sometime during the next year and a half. And what we're doing is creating an entire part of the archive that's dedicated solely to Walt Whitman's fiction. Now, most of you probably know Walt Whitman as a poet or as the author of Leaves of Grass, but he actually also authored 22 short stories and a temperance novel in the 1840s. And you can see an example of one of uh, Whitman's short stories here, Death in the Schoolroom. You can probably guess what it's about uh, from the title. Um, this is actually his first short story. It was written when he was only 22 years old, and it was published in the U.S. Uh, Magazine and Democratic Review um, in August of 1841. And this was actually a prestigious literary journal of the time. It had published the likes of Edgar Allan Poe and Hawthorne. And, uh, what I do in order to make this accessible on the archive is I will take a plain text transcription of the original printing of the text and I will encode that. This is my XML encoding, so this is an example of that. And as you can see, the markup here will allow us to preserve original formatting if we want. So if something appears in italics in the uh, journal, it will also appear in italics on encoded text. After the encoding is done, I will actually do digital scans of the Democratic Review uh, magazine. Um, and they will look a lot like this image right here that you see before you. And when the finished product is up on the web, um, what will happen is you'll be able to access the copy of the text, but you'll also be able to click on a thumbnail and actually see the original periodical pages as well. And I'm really excited to get started on the fiction this fall, um, in part because uh, we recently learned that Walt Whitman's fiction was actually really widely read in the 19th century. So the story that I showed you, Death in the Schoolroom, was reprinted more than 110 times during Whitman's lifetime. And this is actually one of the reprints. This is the Cedar Falls Gazette from Cedar Falls, Iowa, June 29, 1860. And down there beneath the poem, you can actually see Walt Whitman's Death in the Schoolroom reprinted here as Death in a Schoolroom. Okay? And uh, what the Walt Whitman Archive is going to do, in addition to making uh, the fiction text available, we will also be linking to a bibliography of the reprints so that you'll be able to at least uh, see the citations for the reprintings. One day, hopefully in the future, we'll get to actually put all of the text of the reprints up and you'll actually be able to see all of the periodical pages. So I hope that uh, you will come back and check out the Walt Whitman Archive fiction and let me know what you think about the project.